Alright, what's up YouTube? DVD Junior back again with another professional chip review. We have two guests today trying kettle cooked 7 Eleven Select Gouda smoked Gouda chips. Kettle cooked. I'm excited. I'm also excited. I'm very excited. I don't know how they're gonna taste. Uh, you like Gouda cheese, right? Yeah, I don't I like, like Gouda. Gouda's I, great. I don't think I like Gouda. So they might like it, I may not. Who knows? We'll find out. Let's try the chips. Oh, I missed. That was a good pop. Really good pop. Ooh, get away for that. Mm. You know what it smells like? It's like some type of pepper chips. Have you ever tried those? You ever had those? It just smells like normal yeah. pepper chips. Yeah, look, it's like very plain and bland. There's like no seasoning on the chip, first of all. It looks like nothing, just plain. It smells yeah, like it just plain. Looks like yeah, it, it just looks like you overcooked the chip. Alright, we'll see here. Take one. Or take two, I don't know. Whatever you, one. whatever you want. Mm. Kind of chip always folded. There's some slight color to it. Is there? Yeah, okay. but it's, it's not. A... It's more like yellow. It smells and looks mm -hmm. like a pink chip, though. Mm -hmm. Let's try it. Cheers. 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 Oh, we're not eating a plain chip right now. There's like a slight cheesiness to it, but it's yeah, not. Is. It's so faint, though. Yeah, it's really not doing it for me. Not nearly enough seasoning on it. Yeah. Mm. Mm. It's like cheesiness. You're already. <laughs> I'm done already. That's gonna be a little review. I don't know if I would call it gouda. The taste is not like gouda. No, it doesn't taste like gouda yeah. at all. It's it tastes good. like a like a half ass cheddar. Yeah, that's what it tastes like. It's like it literally it does. The it's initial like taste it. is like plain, and the very end, it's like before you swallow, it's like a little bit of like cheddar. It's like generic yeah. cheese. Mm -hmm. But only a little bit. Like if it was a hint of tea. These aren't that good. Struggling to stand, right? <laughs> you want to try another one? Or are you done? No, I'm done. <laughs> yeah, these aren't a good, good score for me. You're way out of frame. Yeah, you're, you're way Sorry. out of frame. Yeah. This is going to be like a high one, maybe, for me. I don't know. I'll give it at least a two. I would um, give it a straight two. Yeah. Nothing more. Because it, it would even be good if it was... It's like a stronger flavor. More okay. Mm -hmm. Are you giving it a two for the taste alone or for tasting like Gouda? Are you giving it a two? So I think for tasting like Gouda, it's like a zero. Oh, yeah. No. no. The flavor is like Gouda. No. No. No, no, no. I'll give it an overall score. Of two? Of, both both yeah. you are giving it a straight maybe, two? Maybe a little more than two because I like the crunchy kettle. Maybe like a 2.5. Well, the texture is great. Yeah. The flavoring was lackluster. Yeah. The seasoning is lackluster. Yeah, the flavor is lackluster. The ratio is... I'll give it... A 1.8. Like, if you had burned your tongue prior to this and you tried this chip, you wouldn't be able to tell it was anything but a kettle cooked chip. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think a 1.8. That's like the last review. <laughs> last three reviews are like 1.8. <laughs> I need better chips. I don't know what it is. Alright, 1.8. They gave it a 2. Um, no, I said 2.5. 2.5? Oh, you went that high? Mm -hmm. 2.5, she gave it a 2. That's the review. Like the video if you like the video and comment other chips we should try for the channel. We're out of here. Professional chip review. Peace. Subscribe. <laughs> Subscribe. <laughs>